Going through your old DVD collection, you grab a movie and casually view the specs on the back. It says the aspect ratio is 1.33 by 1. You grab another movie. This one says 1.37 by 1. You grab yet another movie, and this one says 4 by 3. However, when you play them, they all appear to have the same aspect ratio. Why is it that all these aspect ratios claim to be different, yet they look the same? Is there a difference? If so, what is it? And since we'll be talking about these aspect ratios, I figured it'd be best to shoot this video in, well, 4x3. Now, let's go ahead and compare them. Let's start with an easy one. What is the difference between 1.33x1 and 4x3? Well, there isn't. They're the same aspect ratio. If you divide 3 into 4, you get 1.33. These are just two different ways of saying the same thing. 1.33 by 1 is how it's described in the film industry, whereas 4 by 3 is how it's described in the television industry. They're two separate industries with two entirely different ways of describing the same technical spec. It's the same with today's television aspect ratio of 16 by 9, which in the film industry is referred to as 1.78 by 1. But what is the difference between 1.33 by 1 and 1.37 by 1? 1.33 by 1 was the original agreed upon aspect ratio for filmmakers in the silent era. However, late in the 1920s and into the 30s, sound came along. Some of the space on the side of the film ended up being used for this sound. This compressed the 1.33 by 1 aspect ratio to 1.19 by 1 an aspect ratio that was recently made popular with the film The Lighthouse, directed by Robert Eggers. He used it to give his movie a claustrophobic feel. This aspect ratio, however, was not popular with early audiences. They felt it was too square, which is not how the human eye sees the world. In 1932, the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences established a new standard for movies, 1.37 by 1 also known as the Academy Ratio. This remained the standard for the next two decades, until widescreen movies started to make an appearance in the 1950s. 1.37 by 1 is just slightly wider than the original 1.33 by 1. They're so close in fact, that on a TV screen, they would look almost the same. Even after movies changed their aspect ratio to 1.37 by 1, television still decided to use 1.33 by 1 also known as 4x3. This is the aspect ratio for most older TV sets. And there you have it. Even though these aspect ratios do look the same, they are slightly different and they do have separate histories. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.